the rhythmic tunes, vibrant sets, captivating dialogue of the arts is so often an escape from everyday life. But sometimes the arts do more than entertain and are used to discuss difficult issues. We perceive the stories that, that we get a chance to experience as that's something that happened to someone else, when in actuality it's us. That's the magic. We see ourselves through the depiction of characters and, and the stories that are told. Baylor's upcoming guest production of The Fertile River is a perfect example of art serving a greater purpose. The play focuses on the eugenics movement in 1950s North Carolina and the efforts to sterilize those that were not considered useful. Ultimately, uh, we hope to allow our students to kind of get some more information about exactly what happened in North Carolina with sterilization, what happened with um, individuals there and all throughout the world um, and how people are unjustly treated um, and how we can give voice uh, to those individuals. We're using this as an opportunity to educate, empower, inspire, and allow the art through the Baylor Theater Arts uh, Department to serve as an example of what it looks like to take art and do things that are incredible with it that serve the greater good. Performances of the Fertile River will take place on Saturday and Sunday and tickets are available on the Baylor Theater website. Reporting for LTVN, I'm Riley Seavers.